Okay, guys, so uh, flying off to Bangkok now, and we are going to meet up with a guy uh, in Thailand. His name is uh, Wardash, also known as Pi Boom. And we are going to check out this new field in uh, this place called Samuk Prakan. Uh, they built a nice uh, RC tank battlefield inside an, um, I think it's a Navy base, a Thai Navy base or Air Force base, I wasn't sure which. Um, but yeah, until then. Okay, guys. I got to the wrong place, although my gate is L4, I paid for premium flights. So the premium lounge uh, for AirAsia is in the P&Q section, which is a totally different place. So just so you know, if you, if you want to use your premium flights uh, lounge, P&Q. Okay, so if you buy premium flights, this is the place, the red lounge. Located near PAQ Gates. Okay guys, so we are at Tamiya Bangkok. This is located in Tanya Plaza, uh, near Patong. So, and they have a huge selection of RC tanks. <laughs> yeah, they got all the Pershing. Uh, they've got the Type 10, and many others. There was there was a Sheridan behind as well. So Tim bought something from Tamiya. Oh, helping the Thai economy. Yeah. <laughs> so we are walking out of uh, the plaza and we are walking past the Buddha girls. Buddhas. <laughs> After taking the MRT, some, stop, some stops later, and here we are at Mega Plaza. Apparently, this mall is full of toys. Let's check it out. Yeah, here we are, Mega Plaza. It's actually a big mall, six stories high, uh, hundreds of shops, uh, but not one tank specialist shop, although there were some shops selling tanks, but no specialists. A lot of gun shops though, and figurines, and Iron Man shops, and, and all that. While we were here, 
check out this guy's uh, live streaming. Um, some one piece. One piece. Oh, oh, one piece. They're live streaming now. See the camera set up with the lights and everything, and they're talking. Come to Thailand, must eat Thai food, seafood. Got fried, uh, fried rice with crab and omelette, crabs and river prawn. Look at how big these are. Already. Morning, guys. We are on the way to uh, the RC RC Tank Stores uh, Battlefield in uh, Bangna. Oh, Summer Prakan, sorry, in Summer Prakan. And P Boom is driving. Hello. Okay, so we're on our way. More to come when we get there. Okay, we just got here to the uh, RC Tank Store Battlefield. That's there in the background. A couple of guys there already. A little sunny, but it's actually really cool. I think about 20 degrees. So. This is a royal boat, a really old one, uh, ancient from those days, uh, you know, ancient Thailand. This is about 200 years old, intricately hand carved, overlaid with gold leaf. Yes, I said gold leaf, no shit. They actually put pieces of glass in the prow. It's amazing, and then gold leaf on. On, on the wood as well and uh, there's even more details here this would be the royal cabin with all the glass and this in its heyday must be shimmering in the sun to show the, uh, the might and the power of the time uh, kingdom and over here are some naval torpedoes these are all deactivated without the warheads the warheads in front So downstairs was the full scale boat and this is what it looks like. Uh, this is a scale model of the, the boat or what it would look like in its prime. It, it is uh, overlaid with gold leaf and uh, lots of uh, shiny glass and this is from the looks of it 1 6 scale or maybe one, 1 fourth so imagine how big and how grand these boats are this would be the royal boat as you can see it's escorted by two or more Oh, what is 
So this is a big 30 millimeter gasoline style. And I guess it's full of stuff. So you'll start to get recognized as well. It's probably the same, even more famous during the uh, last summer, right? I think that was quite iconic. And in the background over here is the Louis Machina. Okay, so this is a bigger story. Like, it's like a little bit more like the Louis Machina. Yeah, the biggest that would be World War One. And over here, you can see these are the Japanese World War Two machine guns. These are uh, unique because they have all the pieces on the, on the barrel, as you can see. Hey, US Bazooka. Mm, rocket launcher. Bazooka. Oh, this is a dish stuff. This is the 14.7, I think. Let's see. <laughs> hey guys, we are we are at the Macron station where the market is on the railway tracks. Yeah, yeah you can see there the market is literally on the railway tracks. So when the train comes, everybody just gets out of the way. This is a famous uh, tourist spot. Is that where the train passes? You can see everyone selfieing and all that. Yeah. Okay guys, so we are at Mekong Station where the famous uh, market on the railway tracks is. It's right over there and it's alongside the Shop Raya River. And we'll wait for the train to come. This line is where everybody has moved back so the train will pass through. And you see, see every everybody's uh, stalls on wheels. The train is coming this way and everybody gets out of the way. Hey guys, so we are in the Mike Long uh, train station uh, market where the Market is built literally on the railroad tracks. So as the train passes, everybody pulls back the uh, uh, wares and stalls and moves the tentage out of the way as the train passes by. As you can see, every all of these are uh, you know swivel in and out, and even the 
even the carts on wheels so everybody pulls back and you can see the red line is where the, the line, the safe line is. So, and we're, we're right here waiting for the train. Okay, here it comes. train leaves in about 15 minutes, 10 minutes or so. So we are going to get an angle for that.
We use the uh, public transport MRT and the TBS. Very convenient as long as you know where you're going. Eh, Google Maps helps a lot, so not difficult nowadays. What do you do um, after walking around in Bangkok the whole day? Go for foot massage. Flying back tomorrow. Uh, I'll see for his friends who have an early morning flight, and I will have an afternoon flight. So, yeah. One thing about traveling around Asia is that you will bump into literally a ton of Chinese. Practically every face I see here, and practically every, every uh, voice I hear here is uh, Chinese. Okay guys, so it's been an awesome trip visiting RC Tech Thailand uh, and checking out the uh, new battlefield in the uh, Samo Prakat Naval Base. Uh, so we are very happy to be here and we had an awesome time with the Thai guys and they were very hospitable and took us out to eat. So we are going, to, going home now, um, waiting for my flight to go back to Kuala Lumpur. And, we, uh, and uh, our next event is on the 14th, 15th which is in a few days time. So. Thank you for watching.